What's happening people? Good afternoon, it's Friday. Don't even remember what the date is, but it doesn't really matter. This is a video on what I'm doing next out here. I uh, want to keep the videos coming, but uh, unfortunately my internet's not really good out here all the time, so I'm not able to upload like an edited video real well. So I'm gonna try it from my phone again. It seemed to work okay last time. Um, so what you're looking at here is a table that I welded together for a welding table. And I made this out of a steel shipping crate that was uh, that I purchased a while back. Purchased actually three of them. But um, basically what I'm doing here now is I'm cutting up a bunch of scrap steel that someone gave to me that I got off of Facebook. I mentioned it in one of my videos that some guy had ordered a couple go-karts and I guess they came in this really like elaborate steel cage I mean there was a lot of it so I got a lot of good angle iron it's like one and a half by one and a half eighth inch thick uh, most of it and what you're looking at here are the pieces so I'm gonna take you over here and show you what I've got cut so far and you'll see what I'm up to next here so what you're looking at here are all the pieces that I cut apart and what I'm doing here is I'm actually just piecing together what will soon be a welded truss that I'm going to use for this earth bag structure. Um, I had a lot of initially a lot of elaborate plans for this earth bag structure that I wanted to do. But as a lot of you probably know, plans change. Uh, time has become a factor for me because we need to get out here at the end of June. So I'll have to just save this elaborate roof for another structure. I got plenty of room for those so so here you're looking at the earth bag structure I've been bouncing around from project to project I still am gonna do my second video on the pallet shed um, I got the things done I needed in there for to use it for storage but I still got to put the stucco on and I want to give it a real nice Santa Fe look so in fact this whole area down here is gonna be a Santa Fe themed area we decided we're gonna do our homestead with themes um, we're actually gonna even have a space theme for one area so it'd be kind of cool so anyways what I'm gonna do here with this structure is I want to make um, a truss to support my uh, rafters because the way it works now is the span that I'm looking at from the doorway to the end here is about 20 foot from here to here and the lumber that you can find for that is about 20 foot but that doesn't give me any overhang so that's not really going to do me any good and you know it's about i don't know 43 dollars when, when you include tax per beam so i decided i'm not going to do that i'm still going to have to use wood beams but uh, rafters but i'm going to do it a little different so what i'm going to do is i'm going to make a steel truss so weld it together and it's going to span from here all the way across to here in on the center so it's about 25 foot um so i'm basically just going online and copying what you know companies already sell for this type of thing and just you know the steel is a little bit light gauge wise for what i mean i'd actually want it a little thicker but i'm just going to put more webs in there to make it a little more sturdy but it's going to go from here to here all the way across and then I'll be able to actually, uh, I'll weld some brackets where I can set rafters. So basically you cut the size of the rafters in half. So now I can just buy 12 foot, you know, two by six rafters to span this area here to here. And you know, it, it'll solve my problems and I'll get the stability that I'm looking for. And as we get, you know further out the dimensions get smaller and smaller so that's the idea for that and that's what i'm up to next i'm um, gonna basically start the roof on this thing and then gonna move forward and uh do the next thing so right here we got our concrete and finally on the floor i still got to do a skim coat on this to make it look all pretty but you know it's it's good nothing's cracking it's really nice so worked out well so anyways, folks, happy Friday, and I'll see you soon. 